The Moonlit Stag's Quest, The Enchanted Forest Chronicles Once upon a time, in an enchanted forest called Eternum, there lived a majestic stag named Xavier. Xavier was no ordinary stag, he was gifted with the power of moonlight. His shimmering, silver fur emitted a gentle glow, illuminating the woods with a soft, ethereal light. His antlers were as long and strong as the ancient trees that surrounded him, reflecting the moon's rays like a thousand glittering diamonds. The enchanted forest of Eternum was a harmonious place filled with magical creatures and ethereal beings. Together, they lived in peace, guided by the ancient wisdom of Mother Nature. However, this idyllic world was soon to be threatened by a dark and powerful force. One fateful night, as the moon's soft glow bathed the forest, a mysterious fog rolled in, bringing with it an air of sinister energy. The creatures of Eternum, sensing the encroaching darkness, began to panic. The once peaceful forest was suddenly fraught with anxiety and fear. Realizing the urgency of the situation, Xavier decided to embark on a perilous journey to save his beloved home. Along the way, he would encounter a group of unlikely animal companions, each with their unique skills and abilities. They would join him in his quest, motivated by their love for the enchanted forest and their determination to protect it. Among these companions were Oscar, a wise old owl with unparalleled knowledge of the magical world, Penelope, a brave porcupine with the ability to shoot her quills like arrows, and Zara, a resourceful squirrel with a gift for cunning and stealth. Together, they would form a formidable team, combining their strengths to combat the darkness. The first major challenge Xavier and his companions faced on their journey was a treacherous mountain pass fraught with peril. The group, determined to press on, began their slow and arduous ascent. Xavier, being the strongest of the group, led the way, using his mighty antlers to carve a path through the dense fog. As they climbed, they encountered an enormous, terrifying dragon named Ignatius, who guarded the entrance to the mountain's peak. Ignatius was a creature of the shadows, and he demanded a toll in exchange for passage. Undaunted by the beast's fearsome appearance, Xavier challenged the dragon to a game of wits. If Xavier won, the dragon would allow them safe passage. If he lost, he and his companions would become the dragon's next meal. With the stakes higher than ever, Xavier and Ignatius began their battle of intelligence. The contest lasted for hours, with the two opponents trading riddles and complex puzzles, each trying to outwit the other. Finally, after an intense mental struggle, Xavier solved the final riddle, winning the contest and securing safe passage for his companions. The group, weary but triumphant, continued their journey through the mountain pass. With each step, they felt the darkness drawing nearer, its presence looming like an oppressive shadow over the enchanted forest. As they approached their next challenge, a dense and dangerous swamp, the companions steeled themselves for the struggle ahead. Navigating the swamp proved treacherous, with quicksand pits and hidden traps lurking beneath the murky waters. Penelope, demonstrating her skill and bravery, shot her quills like arrows to create a safe path for the group. 
Oscar, with his wisdom and foresight, guided the team through the maze-like terrain, while Zara used her cunning and agility to navigate the treacherous vines and trees. As they traversed the swamp, they discovered the source of the darkness, a powerful witch named Morgana, who sought to consume the enchanted forest's energy and bend it to her wicked will. Enraged by the discovery, Xavier and his companions resolved to confront Morgana and put an end to her evil scheme. As they reached the witch's lair at the heart of the swamp, they found her standing over a bubbling cauldron, casting spells and weaving her dark magic. The companions wasted no time in launching their attack, each utilizing their unique talents to combat the powerful sorceress. Oscar, using his knowledge of magic, created a protective barrier around the group to shield them from Morgana's spells. Penelope, displaying her fearlessness, fired a barrage of quills at the witch, forcing her on the defensive. Zara, quick and stealthy, darted around the witch's lair, disrupting her incantations and causing her magic to backfire. With Morgana weakened, Xavier stepped forward, his silver fur bathed in the light of the moon. He summoned the full power of his moonlit gift, focusing its energy into a single, powerful beam. As the light struck Morgana, her dark magic began to crumble, her spells dissipating like wisps of smoke. In a desperate, final effort, Morgana hurled one last curse at Xavier and his friends. However, the combined strength of their bond and their love for the enchanted forest proved too strong, and the curse was reflected back upon her. With a shriek of anguish, Morgana disappeared, consumed by her own darkness. With Morgana defeated, the darkness that had plagued the enchanted forest began to dissipate. The oppressive fog that had engulfed Eternum retreated, replaced by the comforting glow of the moonlight. As the companions returned to their beloved forest, they were greeted with gratitude and joy by the magical creatures who called it home. In the aftermath of their harrowing journey, Xavier, Oscar, Penelope, and Zara had formed an unbreakable bond, forged through adversity and the shared love of their home. They had proven that even in the darkest of times, hope, friendship, and courage could triumph over evil. And so, the enchanted forest of Eternum was saved, its peace and harmony restored. The tale of the Moonlit Stag's quest would be passed down through generations, serving as a reminder of the power of unity and the importance of protecting the beauty and magic of the natural world. <laughs>